Here are my top 10 tips for getting the most out of a Google search. I'm Kurt the Cyber Guy, and oftentimes, when trying to search and use Google to find an answer to a specific question, we are overloaded with thousands or perhaps millions of results, but most people browsing online may not even know these tricks to refine your search, so try these when looking for a result. Number one, use the tabs Google provides. Not only can you change the search results to be options like shopping, news, maps, or images, you can also tap more and then see other results such as videos, books, or flights. Using these tabs could cut your search time in half if you're looking for something in one of those categories. Number two, search with quotes. If you wanna find something really specific, a particular term, for example, put it in quotation marks so that Google puts those exact words together while searching. Number three, use a colon to search specific sites. For example, let's say that you're looking up the New York Yankees player Aaron Judge, love him. You'll see lots of articles and photos, but if you wanna see key information from the MLB official website, type Aaron Judge site colon MLB.com and your Google search results will now only be from MLB's website. Cool tip, right? Number four, use the asterisk wildcard. If you're trying to remember a song or movie title and you can't think of the name, using an asterisk in your Google search as a placeholder in your search will let the search engine do some of that work for you. For example, if you type, oh star, can you star? Google will bring up the Star Spangled Banner. Number five, search for websites related to the ones you're looking for. For example, let's say that you're typically visiting CBS, but wanna see results or websites for other stores like CBS, you can type related colon cbs.com and Google will give you results to things that are similar. In this case, Google will bring up other drugstores and pharmacies like Walgreens, Rite Aid, and more. Tip number six, use the plus or minus search if you wanna add or omit specific details to get closer to what you're looking for. Let's say that you're searching for toothpaste brands, but you're not interested in purchasing Crest, even though I use that. You could type toothpaste minus Crest and Google will bring up other toothpaste results that are not Crest. You could also add a plus if you wanted to search for pink sneakers for yourself or your wife, type women's sneakers plus pink. Next tip, use advanced Google search. Most of the tips I've already mentioned can actually be filled out all at once just by skipping to Google's advanced search page. Just Google advanced search and tap that first page and fill out the form to get the most narrowed down search results you can. Tip number eight, set time restraints. If you want news articles about something that happened in say in the last week, you don't wanna get results from years ago popping up, right? So after you Google something, you'll see a tools button to the right of the search tabs. Just select tools and tap anytime and then pick a time frame for when you want to see results from. For example, you can type cyber guy and select results from the past week to find out any scams you may have missed. Tip number nine, solve math equations. Skip opening the calculator app on your phone and use Google as a fast and fun way to perform math equations. Finally, tip number 10, search for specific file types like PDFs, PowerPoints, or Word docs. If you're looking for a file and you're specifically searching a PDF, then you can bring up just that by typing in file type colon PDF. For more Google tips, head to cyberguy.com and search Google. And while you're there, sign up for my free newsletter.